<laughs> if I was going to be a duck, I honestly would want to live in, in Ridgeview Park. Look at that rock. Hi, I'm Alex from the Wildlife Center of Virginia, and today we're talking ducks and geese and other native wild waterfowl. Specifically, we're talking about feeding those animals. It's a really popular pastime to head to a local park and feed the ducks. But as a wildlife hospital, we at the Wildlife Center of Virginia have had a first-hand account as to the negative consequences that can occur when humans feed wildlife. Ducks, yes or no? Yes. Can you think or name any negative impacts that might happen from humans feeding ducks like bread and crackers? And I'm, I don't know for sure, but one thing that would concern me was it fill them with something that's not nourishing that they actually need, A, and B, I don't know if it's like other wildlife, but then they don't fend for themselves as much. So that's about the two that come my mind, but I'm not very knowledgeable. You, no, you're spot on. When wild waterfowl are consuming large amounts of junk food from humans, bread, crackers, popcorn, they are not receiving the nutrients and vitamins and minerals that their bodies need, which is particularly important during their early stages of growth and development. What do you think? Du come up ducks? <laughs> yes or no? Okay, let's not eat the microphone. Miska agrees, <laughs> feeding ducks is bad. <laughs> Sometimes we admit patients that are suffering from metabolic bone disease or angel wing, developmental conditions that affect the health of their bones and skeletal systems for life. Those misshapen and misaligned bones can make it really difficult, if not impossible, for individual birds to forage for food on their own, walk, swim, or even fly properly, and the vicious cycle can continue. If they're unable to forage for food on their own, they become dependent on those junk food handouts. Coincidentally, as we're filming here today, we did come across this litter, this garbage that was left behind. And what do you know, it's a bread bag. So it's a good, good guess that somebody was here feeding the ducks that junk food item. More incriminating evidence, crackers. No crackers for quackers. Should ducks be fed and geese and other waterfowl, do you think they should be fed at all by people? Um, well, we do. Uh, we, have, we buy some at the, uh, at the pet store, actually, for our ducks. We have some in the back. We were going to feed them, actually, just now, um, if we saw any. But I don't know. Maybe, I don't know. We buy it specifically for ducks. I know that a lot of people feed them Cheetos, and that's a bad thing to do. Yeah, so there, there are definitely food items that are more nutritious, that are less harmful for ducks, things that mimic their natural diet. In, in the wild, they're omnivores, so they eat plants and animals, little insects and stuff. So it is possible to find food items that are more healthy, but at the end of the day, they don't really need our help. Most people love wildlife and want to help. But unfortunately, feeding wildlife often causes more harm than good, even if the food items being offered closely mimic their natural diets. Ducks, yes or no? Yes. Yeah, that's the correct answer. Oh uh, yes, I love Duck Dynasty. Um, <laughs> I love <laughs> Duck Donuts. So I'm pretty much I like duck animals. <laughs> ducks. The re the reviews are yeah. in. Thumbs up for duck ducks. I mean, the list goes on. You start thinking about ducks, you're like, no wonder I like these animals. They don't seem to be entirely violent, you know, but they are, you know, I've watched enough National Geographic that they're wild animals for a reason. God made them wild for a reason. <laughs> That's right. Wild animals should stay wild. Right. Or how can a, a wild animal losing its wildness, how could that be harmful? Mm, that's a very good question because if you start feeding and it's familiar with humans, it might not be able to know how to defend itself in the wild. Yeah, uh, that's entirely correct. So becoming habituated to humans is easy, especially when there's food involved. Uh, they, the, these animals, they want what most animals want, which is an easy to access food source that's high value and low effort. So when they come, that's like most of us, right? In addition to harming individual animals, feeding ducks can also harm the environment as a whole. When an unnaturally high number of animals are drawn to a small space, that can cause overcrowding, where the number of animals outweighs what the ecosystem can naturally support. It disrupts the entire food chain. Overcrowding can also drastically increase the likelihood that harmful diseases, parasites, and viruses will be passed from animal to animal. Ducks, yes or no? Yes. 
Correct, another correct answer, yes. Ducks, yes or no? She'd rather go for the squirrels and the skunks. Oh, the yeah, squirrels, yes, ducks, no. Uh, do you think feeding ducks is a good idea or a bad idea? I'm not sure what to make of that, but I'm having a great time right now. <laughs> you know it, I know it, let's all save together. What goes up will come down. Balloon fragment. Can be ingested by wildlife, degrades the environment, etc., etc. No good. What goes up will come down. Ducks, yes or no? Yes. Can you think of any ideas or suggestions that you might have to somebody who's looking for, for other ways to help wildlife or help ducks or geese in particular? Well, you guys are from the, wild, the Wildlife Center. Uh, you guys are very close by. Maybe come see you guys and ask some questions. Yes, that's a wonderful answer. Visit our website, wildlifecenter.org, our social media channels. Learn about wildlife, learn about what species are in your area to better help them be wild animals. It's great. Pack a camera or binoculars, <laughs> not duck bread. Agreed, yes, yes. Luckily, there are plenty of alternatives that people can do instead of feeding these animals to feel good outside and feel like they're helping the environment. You can organize a trash pickup. Very often in aquatic ecosystems, we can find discarded fishing lines and lures, sinkers and fishing hooks. These can be ingested by wild animals, especially waterfowl, and can cause serious harm. Look, more evidence. plastic wrapper of some sort, perhaps a food item, a popsicle maybe, whatever it is, it belongs in the trash can. If you think feeding ducks is a problem at your local park, talk to your Parks and Recreation Department and work together to put up educational and informative signs. Thanks for watching this video. If you'd like to help us spread our educational messages, share this video, like and comment, and let us know what topics you'd like for us to cover next. Head, in, head, in, <laughs> head into the parks and you see some ducks. If you want to feed them, you're out of luck. When I see people giving them crackies, it makes me pretty angry, want to give them a slappy. We don't condone violence, though. Education, not violence. No crackers for quackers. No crackers for quackers! No crackies for quackies. No crackies, not my quackies. What do you think that squirrel is thinking about? Maybe he's thinking how life is pretty nuts. Hey squirrel, I bet you Ro didn't know not to feed ducks. Sir, a question. Can we interview? Please, sir.